Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a very exciting video. This is actually going to be a kind of a review and demo of the Urban Decay Naked Basics. This is the um, new palette that was just released. I was actually able to get my hands on it early. My Sephora is awesome. They had the stock obviously because I think it was in stores on the 22nd and they just sold it to me sooner. So um, that's why it's good to make friends with everybody there. Um, so I have had a chance to use it. I've been, you know, using it. Um, it, it's amazing. I just have to tell you, let me just like show you, I'll do swatches and everything. Um, it looks like this when you get it, I mean, a huge mirror. Um, it looks like this comes with this little brush that um, is actually not that bad. Um, it's like a little a double side. This is like a flat side and this is like a little stubby brush. I've actually used this um, to kind of like smudge color under my eyes, just like real fast. And um, it's it's not bad, <laughs> you know, it's, it's good. Um, at least it's, you know, not totally crappy, but um, this is is what we're talking about. This is the the color, and what you know what 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 I will do is this that way I can show you guys. Um, they're all mattes with the exception of this one shade here, which is kind of a um, like more of a sheen to it. It's not really shimmer or anything. But um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through. I'm going to swatch them all for you, and just kind of um, show you you know what they look like. And then I also filmed a quick eye demo um, using these colors that I will insert at the end to, um, to show you how they perform. Um, so I'm going to start with the top row. Um, the first shade is called Blow. Again, that is the one that is kind of, um, kind of has a, a sheen to it. The one next to it is the shade Nudie, which is so funny. Um, so those are the, the two right there. This is Blow. And this is Nudie, which is almost like the same color as my skin tone. Um, the next one is Commando, which is gorgeous. It is right here. Um, the one next to that is Tempted, which is kind of a more of a cool tone purpley color. Right there, that's Tempted. That one was Commando. And then Nudie and Blow. And then we have Instinct, which is a gorgeous, I haven't even um, gotten to play with Instinct yet. It's right there. This is just a gorgeous, um, definitely a more, it reminds me kind of a Blackberry from MAC. Um, and then the next, next to, or the last one is Lethal, which I'm going to swatch here, which is, oh God, talk about a gorgeous, you know, deep, you know, bronzy, not even bronzy, but just like a, a rich chocolatey brown. That is, that is gorgeous. Um, then the next row I'm going to show you is down here. I'm going to start this side. This is called Pregame, which is kind of a matte, um, yellowy, kind of a yellowy matte right can you even see it right here then we have what is this called extra bitter which is kind of funny <laughs> oh, that is your typical oh my god look at that that is your typical like reddish brown that's gonna look good on like blue eyes and green eyes um i think it'll even look good on brown eyes i haven't you know like i said played with it yet or anything but that is really pretty then the next one is faith which is one of my favorites right here again just like that rich pigmented you know, brown. And then the next one is look, what's that? <laughs> lockout. Um, right here, which like those two, Faith and Lockout, are my two favorites. Definitely. Um, they are a little bit powdery. <laughs> Just blow off the excess. And then the next one is Magnet, which is again, you're just your typical dark gray. And then of course your black. You can't go wrong with a black shadow. Um, personally, I don't really use black that much, but it's good if you want to use it as a liner or whatnot. Um, so that is the bottom row. The bottom row is definitely a little bit darker, um, definitely more pigmented, but look at these. Look at these. I'm going to like back up so you can see all of these shadows. Oh my god. I mean, it has a good mix of cool and warm tones. Like for me, I like to mix cool and warm on my eyes. It just gives them some definition. That's what I did today. You'll see in the in the demo. But um but look at those. <laughs> look at those colors. Like this reddish brown is gorgeous. These two, like I said, are my favorite. Um the top this blowout is just phenomenal. I have it on my lid and my brow bone. Um it's like the most perfect shade because it's not it's not like a flat matte white which is gonna be really harsh. It's just kind of like a creamy um shimmery shade. And then of course these up here, which are just beautiful. So that is the swatches and everything. I hope that helps somebody if you were kind of on the fence about it. Um, personally, I would say get it. Um, 
it, it the naked basics like the little ones i think they're like 26 dollars they retail for and this is i think 52 um but f i mean you're basically getting you know 12 shadows for i, I mean it, it equates to um to a decent you know percentage you know per shadow um, I hope this helps somebody. What I'm going to do is, like I said, just insert the, the little demo of the eye look. Um, it's actually what I'm wearing. Um, hope that helps somebody. Like I said, if you have this, let me know, um, and I will cut to the demo. Hey guys, I'm here with the demo part of this video. I'm going to take a beautiful palette. I'm going to go in with this shade, um, Commando right here, which is kind of like a neutral, um, mid-tone crease crease color and I'm just going to blend this kind of all over my eye. I'm um, not really being too precise with this because it is just kind of like one of those easy colors you could just throw all over your crease. And um, I've already primed my eyes with the MAC um, Paint Pot in Camel Coat. I talked about this a lot um, a couple years ago. Um, I just kind of refill in love with it. I've actually put a big dent in it. Um, I like the NARS one but that has like a hint of like a pink in it almost and this is just really flat neutral um so it just works well with like a lot of the neutral um looks that i do so anyway that is that and then i'm going to take the um this more of like a tapered uh crease brush and i'm going to go in with the shade um right down here which is faith it's a little bit of a darker brown it's like actually right under commando and i just i'm going to take this a little bit more precise um on the brush and i'm going to work this into my crease really kind of keeping this one um, being a little bit neater with this one again and just really working it into the crease not kind of going everywhere but I just really want to work that just back and forth just to kind of define the crease a little bit more and these are super pigmented as I've mentioned so you really want to tap off your brush because you will get a lot of pigmentation and this again we're just taking this color it's just slightly darker just to define the crease. Okay. okay, so then what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna throw on just a little bit of a lid color. I'm gonna take the um, lighter shade, which is Blow, which I think that's, that's the one that has like a little bit of a sheen to it. And I'm just going to place this just kind of all over my lid okay just slightly on my lid just to kind of brighten it up a little bit okay see that okay so then i'm going to take a good old mac 217 i'm going to go in with this shade which is tempted right here next to commando it's a little bit um cooler and i'm just going to work that kind of into my outer crease. This palette is so good just for building colors and really good at layering. So I'm just going to again work that in kind of my outer crease, working it in a little bit slightly. Okay. Then <laughs> we are almost done. I'm just going to keep this like really quick, really easy. Um, my camera shut off like just randomly <laughs> as I was in the middle of talking. Um, but what I was saying was we are going to just uh, finish it off with just a color under the eye, which I'm going to go in with the, um, I guess a mixture of um, Faith and Tempted. Um, they're a little bit of cool, a little bit of warm. I just want to kind of mix those two and just kind of blend that under my eye. Um, what I was saying is we're just kind of keeping this a really soft, easy look. Um, you can do so many different versatile looks with this. I just didn't want to, you know, go crazy. I just want to show you really easily what we can do with it. I'm just sweeping that under my eye. And that is it. I'm going to finish off with my um, liner and mascara, and I will be right back to wrap this up. Okay, guys, I am back. I did my liner and mascara and what I did was I just took a little fluffy brush like this and I took that blow shade which is that kind of um shimmery but not really shimmery but just like a little bit of a um sheen to it and what I did was put that in my brow bone so I just touched that up again so you can see so this basically is the whole look um it is just a beautiful neutral 
you know, I wouldn't even call it a smoky eye. It's just like a really easy neutral, um, kind of a smoky eye, but not um, full on, you know, bam. Um, just really soft, easy colors. I absolutely love it. If you love neutrals, if you have the other palettes and you want to add this kind of to your collection, I highly recommend it. It is phenomenal. I will definitely get a lot of use out of it. Um, like I've said previously, it is just gorgeous. And if you have gotten a chance to pick this up and you've played with it, let me know what you think. It's just, in my opinion, it's definitely a must have. Um, Urban Decay has, they have outdone themselves with this palette. So I will see you guys in my next video. Uh, please give this one a thumbs up. If you like this kind of, you know, review and demo together, um, if you want to see more of it, I know there are a lot of palettes coming out this um, holiday season. Let me know um, what you want to see. And if you are not subscribed, please subscribe, um, hit the button down below, and I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching, guys.